Well, I better get ready for class. Whoa, this is so cool. Hmm, what hairstyle should we choose? Not green. I think I know. We'll go for number three. Ugh, what is that supposed to be? Let go, it's mine! I want to see it! Whoa! What happened? You're finally here at last. Welcome to the art challenge! I guess we better get started. First up, we have… Drum roll, please! A rainbow! Wow, I love rainbows! Let's just get on with this. I need something for my bag. Ooh, I'll check my bag. What have I got? That's your bag? Aha! I can use it for my drawing. Hey, I forgot I had this. Mmm, it still smells good. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna throw up. Eh, I'm just messing. I just need a pen. A diamond encrusted pen, of course. Ugh, where did this come from? Mmm, that gives me an idea. Hey, Kendall! Get it away from me! Ugh, so gross. Okay, I'll start by folding the paper. I'll place the pencil tin on it and use it to draw a circle. Then I'll draw a face on it. I'll start with the eyes. I'll split the smile over the folds. What a lovely smile. Now I'll open the paper up. I'll use my money as a ruler. I'll join up the face. Then it's time to add some color. I want it to be as bright as possible. And I'll draw a rainbow inside the mouth. Now I can fold the paper back over. It looks great! Check it out! It's pretty good, huh? Wow! My jaw is dropping! Brittany hasn't even started yet. There must be something I can use. Oh hey, I found my old chalk. I can definitely use this. I just need my trusty hammer. I'll quickly make a butterfly stencil. I'll place it on a sheet of black card. Next, I'll put the chalk on it. And then, it's bashing time! Oh yeah, that feels good! This really works out my tension. Now I can remove the stencil. I'm left with a beautiful butterfly. Excellent work, girls! I know! It's such a tough decision, but Brittany wins! Really? Wow, thanks! Ugh, that's so unfair! Hey, I like your drawing. Sorry, gotta keep my potassium levels up. This is the next challenge. All this work is making me hungry. Get me something to eat! Ooh, this is more like it. It all looks so delicious. What should I try first? Whoa, that does look good. I want it. Get your grubby hands off it. I don't want you touching my food. Come on, you won't eat all of it. Fine, I'll give you an egg. Catch. Whoa, easy. Don't drop it. Phew, that was close. Thanks for this. I'll crack the egg into a bowl. I want to keep the yolk separate. I'll put that in another bowl. I'll use my fingers to break it. Hmm, it feels all slimy. Next, I'll add a small amount of oil. Just a little more. Now I can stir it. Next, I'll fill a syringe with the mixture. It makes it easier to work with. And it's not as messy. I'll add the egg mixture to powdered paint. I don't need a lot. Just a few drops. I'll use a brush to mix the egg and paint together. That looks about right. Now I'll take the eggshell and crush it slightly. I want to break it into small pieces. I'll take this piece of the shell and I'll paint it blue. I love this color. I've drawn a vase and I'll stick the shell onto it. Then I'll add flowers. Mmm, I couldn't eat another bite. Wait, maybe I eat too much? Whoa! Oops, my bad. Better out than in. I don't want to waste any food. Hmm, maybe I can create something with it. I've painted a sheet of card blue, and I'll use the broccoli as a brush. I'll dab paint over the paper. I'll use different colors. It gives an amazing leaf effect. Check it out! Ooh, that's pretty! I love it! Very creative! How do I decide? It's tough, but Kendall wins! Yes! I'm the greatest! Okay, take it easy, Picasso! What's it doing? I'm so confused. I think it's supposed to be a shadow puppet. Ooh, I love those! It's tragic. That's what it is. Nope. It's not any clearer. It's a dog. Why didn't you say so? Hey, Claire, look! Trick shot! Pretty cool, huh? I know she's impressed. I'm really not. Let's get this over with. 
What's he doing? I'm gonna draw around my hand! Please stop talking. I'll show you. I'll place my hand on the paper like this. Then I'll draw around it. It won't look much to begin with, but just wait until I add the details. I'll start with an eye, and then a cute little nose. I'll fill it in black, and I'll do the same with the other eye. And I'll do the same with the eye. I'll leave a small white dot. That'll be the light reflection. Then it's time for the fur. And it'll need a collar. We don't want it getting lost. Please stop singing. I'll only sing louder! It's so bad. Drawing a little doggy. I can't take it anymore. You're making me so mad. I'll crush you. Each note is piercing my brain. Make it stop! Ugh. Look at what you've made me do. Hold on. I think I can work with this. I'll start by spreading the chalk dust out. You know, that feels good. It's pretty soothing. I can feel the tension melting away. I'll draw an upside down love heart, then two small circles, and a triangle. It's already looking like a dog. These will be the ears. I'll give my dog brown fur. This is the easy part. I just need to stay within the lines. I wish every drawing could be like this. It's almost done. Now for a big red tongue. I wish I had a dog. It would be my best friend. We could go for walks all the time. I better focus on what I'm doing. I think I'm done! It looks pretty good. No, it doesn't. Come on. I have to win this round. I used my hand as a template. Can you see the resemblance? I can't pick mine up. Yes! I won! I'm the greatest! Nah, nah. Don't push it, Leo. Oops, sorry. Ugh, I'm so angry. Whee! Look at it go! Take a look at your next challenge. How exciting! Are you kidding? I've no idea what we're supposed to do with that. Aw, there's a loose thread on my shirt. There's another one. That's all I need. Hmm, maybe these might come in useful. Ooh, makeup! Maybe Kendall won't notice. This is my chance. Just act natural. Nothing to see here. The perfect crime. I'll cover the thread in strength. Then I'll put it on my notebook. I'll arrange it in a wave pattern. Then I'll close the notebook over. I'll pull the thread. It leaves behind an abstract painting. It looks great! Wow, that's actually quite impressive. Wait, Brittany! Yes? Oh, uh, how did that get there? Keep it. I'll use this brush. I'll paint my canvas black, but I'll stop halfway. Then I'll apply a line of glue. I'll brush the glue over the black paint and the blank canvas. Just like this. Before it sets, I'll sprinkle glitter over it. I need to be quick. Phew. This is hard work. Huh? Is that gold? That'll look great on my painting. Even my dandruff is rich. I should buy better shampoo, though. I'll place a heart stencil onto the canvas. And grab a can of spray paint. I'll go over the stencil with it. It's so vibrant! I'll carefully remove the stencil. Wow! I'd hang that on my wall. It's good, isn't it? Oh yeah. Wait until you see this. Whoa! My eyes! I can't see! Put it down! That's better. Wow! It's wonderful! It is pretty special. Give me a warning next time. Wait. That's supposed to be fashion? Yikes. It's like something my granny would wear. Decisions, decisions. There's no accounting for taste. Look at her. Oh, sorry. I'm something of a fashionista. What? Oh my god. I want you to design a dress. Who knows? I could wow. be wearing it on the catwalks of Paris. Ooh, I like this challenge. I've got some big plans. Hmm. I don't know what to do. Well, I can't waste time. Oh yeah! This is looking good! I'm about to change the fashion world! It's… it's terrible! I don't even know how that happened! This is all wrong! Ooh, fancy! I need to get into the right frame of mind! Hey, careful! I need to think like the dress. Oh no. Be the dress. Hmm. I wonder. Hmm. I think I have an idea. It's worth a shot. I need one more thing. But what? I know. I'll be right back. Mmm, a big chunk of apple juice. This is just what I 
need. I'll need to open the napkin up. Then I can start to make folds along the top. I want to create pleats. I'll just pinch and fold. It should look like a fan shape. Now I can stick it to my drawing. I'll need some glue. That should be enough. Then I'll press it into position. It's that easy. So elegant. So chic. But it is a little plain. I want it to be a showstopper. I better grab my paintbrush. I'll add some polka dots to it. Those always look good. I'll use different colors of paint. This dress will be a real head turner. I'll paint the polka dots halfway down. It'll be so unique. Wow! I love it! It's beautiful! I can't wait to show the principal! All this thinking is making me hungry. Wow! Look at Annie's drawing! It's so pretty! What am I gonna do? Wait a moment. A bowl of juicy fruit! I want it! I'll take that. The perfect crime. Mmm, those look good. I'm gonna enjoy this. Uh, can I have one? Nah, nah. They're all mine. That's just mean. Like I care. Oops. I missed my mouth. I need to clean it up. Ha! Karma! Hang on. Maybe I can use this. I know what to do! This dress will be good enough to eat. I'll arrange the raspberries like this. Then I can add the blueberries. What a great idea! Mother Nature would be so proud. I'm glad I didn't eat them all. I don't want to run out of fruit. I want to create a long, flowing dress. I just need to add a few more blueberries. Wow! It's stunning! It's ready for the catwalk. Hey, principal! Oh, you finished already. I hope you like it. What a yummy dress! I agree. I can see you wearing this. Try to flatter me, huh? Both dresses are excellent, so you both win! Congratulations! Yes! Put her there! Annie? Where is she? Oh, I should've known. I can explain! <sighs> Help yourself. Just don't tell the principal. <sighs> School is so boring. I can't wait to get out of here. Hmm. Now's my chance. Let's add a splash of color. Uh, what are you doing? Put the paintbrush down! Another day, another dollar. Uh, what's going on? No! It got me! Uh-oh. Just act cool. That's it. Now you're in trouble! Come at me, bro! He did it! He did it! I guess I better clean up. Ugh. Look at this. You're such a nerd. Hey! Focus! This is your first challenge. That seems easy enough. But which one? Right or left? How… how are you doing that? Meh. It's not a big deal. I do yoga. You should try it. Where's my paintbrush? Ah, here it is. Okay, let's do this. I'll start with some yellow. This is gonna be great. You know, all this creativity is making me hungry. Luckily, I've got these chips. Mmm, tasty. This might be my best work yet. It'll be a masterpiece. Oops. Got some crumbs on me. That's better. I am so confused right now. I'm happy with that. I think I'm done. Check it out. I mean, some of the brushwork is a little sloppy, but it'll do. Are you kidding me? Okay, watch this. Ow! I'm not that flexible. Phew. That stinks. I'll make a print with my foot. Then I'll paint around it. Now I'll go over the foot. And I'll add some white paint. That's good. I'll go around the paint with a black pen. This'll give it an outline. I'll draw a nose. And now an eye. Just look at those eyelashes. I'm jealous. It's a pretty horse, but it can be even more magical. I'll turn it into a unicorn. I think I'm done. What do you think? Pretty impressive, huh? Go on. Admit it. Huh. Please. This is art. I'll be the judge of that. I've always been partial to unicorn. Woohoo! I won! What? Are you serious? I'm so bored. Are you kidding? It's snack time! 
Mm. Let's make things more interesting. Alley oop! Incoming! Got it! I know, it's impressive. Think you can beat that? Please, I could do that with my eyes closed. Check this out. I'm about to blow your mind. Ugh, my eye! What was that you were saying? Keep practicing, you'll get it eventually. Ahem. I want you to paint a rainbow. And it better be good. I love <laughs> rainbows. I, I don't do colors. Who's laughing now? I can't wait to get started. There's just something magical about them. What are you doing? Oh, he's such a nerd. Annie, what are you waiting for? Get on with it. If I have to. But I only like black. Let's get this over with. If you want a rainbow, I'll give you a rainbow. It'll be the best rainbow ever! I finished! I wanted to capture the beauty of it. Do you like it? We've our very own Van Gogh in class! How's it going, Annie? Ta-da! It's okay, you can hold the applause. You have seen a rainbow, right? Ugh, this class is so stupid! This is what I think of your rainbow! Wait a second, give me those pens. I'll arrange them in the order of a rainbow. Then I'll need my glue gun. I'll glue the pens together. Then I'll wait for the glue to set. Now it's time to draw. I'll run the pens across the paper. I'll create an arc with them. Wow, this is looking good. The colors are blending together. This is such an easy way to draw. That's it, but I'm not done yet. I used a black pen to draw a rainbow on a plastic wallet. No rainbow? Rainbow. Pretty cool, huh? Now you see it, now you don't. Oh, it's back again. What kind of sorcery is this? Wow, that's amazing! My work here is done. Wait a second, you have a multicolored t-shirt on! Huh? I thought you only liked black! What? No! You didn't see that! Don't Shh. say a word or else! My lips are sealed. Hmm, I have a good idea. Let's try something with numbers this time. It's okay, there's no need for applause. Math, I thought this was supposed to be a game. I'm not sure what we're meant to do here. I'm admiring myself and you're ruining the ambiance. Ugh, he's rude, isn't he? Let me think. There must be something we can use. Ooh, this could be useful. You can never go wrong with a math book. Maybe I'll find the answer between these pages. Hmm, let's have a look. Nope, this won't do. I don't have a field. Or cows. This is just what I need. I knew this book wouldn't let me down. I've got my pen. It's time to get to work. I'll start by drawing the numbers 1 and 2. 3 and 4 can go over here. Then I need to join them together. I'll draw some additional lines. And then a big long loop. Now for the finishing touches. It's a cute elephant, and it was made from numbers. Is there anything math can't do? I'm so proud. Huh. Yeah. Whatever. Wait a second. That's your big idea? I can beat that. I'm about to blow your mind. I'll draw two small ovals. Then I'll draw two more below them. Finally, I'll draw larger ones at the bottom of the page. Then I'll get creative. Next, I'll draw the feet. It looks like it's sitting up. Oh, I can't forget about the ears. That's better. Now, I'll add details to the eyes. It'll make a difference to the finished product. I'll add some lines to the trunk. It's going to be so cute. And it'll actually look like an elephant. I'll give it some nails. And then a nice wavy tail. It's time to color it. I'll use black for the eyes. I don't want to mess it up now. This gray is perfect for the body. There, I'm finished. It looks amazing. Now that's an elephant. <laughs> that's actually pretty good. But it's not up to us. Hey, we're ready. You're done? Wow. Oh, isn't that adorable? Bravo, Luna. But where are the numbers? Wait, what? I thought we weren't drawing elephants. Well, there's only one winner. Congratulations. Thank you. I'd like to thank my mom, my dad, and my dog, Rover. Better get ready for the next challenge. This seems like the right time. Stacy, this is for you. I hope you like them. Uh-huh, are you serious? No, I can't. Ew, a gift for me? Nope, it's for Stacy. Really? I wonder what it is. Oh, look at it! What? It's just a stupid unicorn. I'll never understand women. Oh, it's from my crush! He's the best. I'll treasure this forever. That gives me an idea for the next round. A unicorn. 
Are you joking? Fine, let's do this. Nope, this isn't going well. It's so soft! Ooh, there's something else in the box. Is that candy? It sure smells like candy! Mmm, it's yummy! Huh? What's happening? Wait a second! I think I've got it! It's time to draw! I'll draw the outline of the unicorn on graph paper. Then I'll go around the outline. Trust me, this'll be good. Next, I'll start to add some details. This'll be the hair. Now I fill in the outline. It makes it stand out. Now I'll add the color. It's gonna look so pretty. I just need to make sure I stay inside the lines. I'll make the horn multicolored. That's good. I'll add the finishing touches. All done! Lily, I'm finished! Time is running out! What? How? What am I gonna do? <sighs> This'll have to do. Uh, ta-da! Uh, at least you tried. Well done, Stacy. It looks great. The less I say, the better, Matthew. Stacy wins. There's no contest. Yeah, I know. Woohoo! I I've almost finished my homework. This drawing is gonna be great. Really? I want to see. No, it's still a work in progress. Be patient. It's done and it's beautiful. What do you think? <laughs> oh, it's uh. What is it? Is it a potato? Hold on. Maybe if I squint. Oh, I see it now. It's a duck! What? No? I, I knew that. I need a closer look. Like a really, really close look. Ah, it's so obvious. It's a lemon, isn't it? No, it's not a lemon. Right, I was afraid you'd say that. Hmm, this is tricky. What am I missing? Are you kidding me? Of course, it's obviously a banana! You know, just forget it. I'm sorry, sweetie. What is it? It's Pikachu! Is it? This isn't good. Ooh, I wonder what grade I got! An F? Aw, this is the worst! She would be devastated. But I think I can fix this. I'll place Pikachu right here. Hmm, I'll need to sharpen this pencil. That reminds me. I need to buy a pencil sharpener. Ah, that's better. I'll take another pencil. Then I'll wrap a rubber band around them. I'll do the same at the other end. Now I'll draw around the image. I just need to follow the lines. The second pencil will trace it onto a blank piece of paper. It's so much easier than drawing freehand. There! It looks pretty good. I don't need this anymore. Now I need to add some color. What do you think, Ava? Wow, it's perfect! Thanks, mom! I better get ready for school. I don't want to be late. Have a good day, honey. Go get that A. Oh no! Ava! Wait! I'm so hungry. I need a snack. Hmm, the teacher's busy. This is my chance. I always keep a snack under here in case of emergencies. Ah, there it is. I'll need to be quick. She'll be so mad if she sees this. What's that, candy? Hey! Uh, just ignore this. You didn't see a thing. Wh what Don't you dare! You can't stop me! That's disgusting, Ava! I'm so ashamed of myself right now. But I don't regret it. I'm going to pretend that didn't happen. That didn't satisfy my snack attack. Luckily, I hid these chips. Mmm, these should do the trick. I'll need to hide them. Meh, my pencil holder will do. Just be cool. It's just another normal day. Mmm, that tastes so good. I needed that. Open wide. Oh, that's kind of you. Wait a second. That's weird. I don't have a third hand. <gasps> Hello, Ava. No chips allowed. Do you hear me? Oh, I hear you. But you didn't say anything about donuts. What's going on back there? Uh-oh. Divert, divert. I'm watching you. Whatever. I'm too smart for her. Haha! <laughs> gotcha! What? Uh, ooh, that's a bad itch. Hmm, something isn't right. She's a crafty one. This calls for some drastic action. I knew this mannequin would come in handy. Now I need to give it a makeover. That's it, keep looking away. That's what I'm looking for. Mmm, I think I've earned this. It's the most delicious looking donut ever! Pink frosting and sparkles. It's a work of art! 
Do not eat that. I mean, do not eat that. I've warned you. No! Wait, you're bald? Give me it. Ugh, this is so unfair. You better not eat it. Let go. Right now, Ava. If you only put this much effort into your schoolwork. No more, got it? Now I have marking to do. Yes, fine. Wait a second. I have a great idea. I'll start by drawing two small circles. Then I'll join them up. I'll do the same on the top half. Next, I'll draw a wave pattern. I'll do this all the way across. Then on the top half. Once I've sketched it in pencil, I can go over it with a pen. This'll make it stand out. It's just a case of following my rough drawing. I won't make any mistakes. It looks just like a donut! I can use an eraser to get rid of the pencil. Then I'll color it in. I'm only filling in the section inside the wavy line. This'll be the frosting. Mmm, my mouth is watering. Next, I can color the donut. I'm using a dark orange for this. I'll use a correction pen for the sprinkles. I'll dab it over the frosting. Then I'll add some shadowing. It's just a case of going around the edges. I'll do the same with the sprinkles. It makes it look more realistic. I think that's it! Now for stage two. It's time for the old switcheroo. You're mine, donut. And I'll leave the drawing in the box. Huh? Who's there? I'm sure I heard something. Hmm. What? Is something wrong? I'm reading my book. Okay, but I'll be keeping my eye on you. Who knew books would be so useful? It's great for hiding my donut! Hurry along. Get to your next class. They're all gone at last. I've been looking forward to this. Wait. What's going on? This isn't a donut! I've been tricked! Ava! I'll quickly touch up my lipstick. Hmm. Where is it? That's better. Ah! That's what I'm looking for! Thanks, Annie! Uh, what are you doing? No! Don't! I love this shade. That's mine! Remember that. Wow, talk about being touchy. Oh, no, you didn't! Stop it, Ava! I mean it! This is starting to get annoying. Knock it off! Watch this! Ooh, so pretty! You can play that game! How do you like that? Oh yeah? Beat that! This suits me better than you! You look like a clown! A really bad clown! Stop! I'm done with this! Ha! It's mine. All mine. Nice try, Annie. Uh-oh. Maybe it wasn't my lipstick after all. Well, this is awkward. I need to apologize to Annie. Hang on. I have an idea. I'll need my 3D pen. I'll use it to make a loop around the lipstick tube. I'll keep going around. I want to build up the layers. Just like this. I'll work my way to the back of the tube. Then once I get to the end, I'll start to fill in the bottom of the tube. I want to cover it completely. That's perfect. I've used the 3D pen to make a letter A. I'll stick it to the tube. That's it. I'm finished. Oh, here comes Annie. Uh, Annie? This is for you. Huh? What is that? Is that my lipstick? Whoa! That is so cool! Thanks, Ava. I'm sorry. <laughs> Look what I found. No way! That's just like mine! Hmm. This is way more interesting. What are you? Wait. What are we doing here? Oh no! Whatever! <laughs> I feel like we're being watched. Pika? Huh? Oh no! What's that she's holding? See you soon, ladies. <laughs> Whoa! Up high! No thanks. So weird. This is boring. Mm. Aww. Aren't they precious? Draw what you see. Hmm. Oh, I absolutely love it! Pika, Pika! We get to draw Pika! Easy, easy! It's Pikachu, see? Okay, wanna play with this thing? Ooh, I like this. In fact, I'm suddenly very inspired. Why draw when I can fold? Just make a big crease down the middle. Now take this top flap down and fold it again. Make sure to get that crease. Now it's time for some drawing. 
Can you tell what it is yet? Don't worry, you will soon! Aww, look at that cute ear! Gotta make sure both sides match! Aww, a little pika! Which means lots of yellow! That's my favorite color! But you probably could have guessed that! Add some red! I'm more of a freehand gal. And to me, Pikachu is kinda bunny-like. And as much as I hate it, the color really does add something. I still am partial to black, though. Almost done here. Once folded, this looks like a Pokeball! Pika! Pika! Well, girls. All done. Yep. Oh, wow! I love it! Who knew you could draw something so cute? But mine's more realistic! Double wow! Thanks a lot! Ugh. I can do that too, you know. Aw, here. Take mine! Are you sure? That's really nice of you. Whoa! Look! It's me! Ugh. No touching. Okay, just lightly. What's next? Whoa! That spider's huge, huh? Ah! How inspiring. Inspiring? It's a spider! Hey! Aw. Your turn. Uh, here. Just use this. Cool! I guess this isn't too scary. I won't draw it that way anyway. As long as it doesn't jump off the page. Can you tell what it is yet? It's not a spider, exactly. But close enough. I'd better get to it. Luckily for me, spiders are a subject I'm quite comfortable with. As I always say, the creepier the better. It's amazing what some simple lines can do! <laughs> this pick is so gonna win! Hope there's enough red ink in here. Cause this guy loves him some red! Nice! Black is my color of choice here. It's scarier, after all. And a little red to make it dangerous. I'm all done. What do you think? Scary enough for ya? Creepy! Oh, yeah. Ta-da! Hello, sweet little thing. Huh? Ugh! Here's my Spider-Man! Nice and friendly! He's a superhero, you know! Now, save the day! Whoa! You've gotta be kidding me. Oh well. So Morning, Julie! Isn't my new mug spectacular? Aw, it's so sweet! Can I see it? No way, Butterfingers! Okay, then. I've gotta find somewhere to keep this thing. Those shelves are pretty tall. Julie can never reach all the way up here. Not even in heels. See ya! She's not looking, is she? Time to mug that mug! Gah! I'm so close! I can practically taste it! Ah! Yes! Oh no! I can't believe it! I'm so dead! I've gotta hide the evidence! Who looks under here anyway? My 3D pen! Maybe I can fix this after all! Start by getting a shape with foil. Once you've covered the whole piece, let it dry, then take it off. Next part takes some real creativity. Let's start with a big red heart. Don't forget to fill it all in. Use lines going up and down over and over. And we're done! I've gotta be really quiet here. There! <laughs> Let's see… Uh-huh, this mug is just the cutest! I can totally fit another pen up my nose. Uh-oh. In today's lesson, you get to draw a cute birdie! Whoa! You mean it? This is my kind of class. This is gonna be fun. I'll start with the outline. So far, so good! Now the eyes and wings. It's time to color it! I want it to be so bright! Wow! I love it! 
I could do this all day. This purple is perfect for the wings. I'll color the legs yellow. It's gonna look amazing. I just need to stay inside the lines. I'll use the yellow for the beak, too. I don't want to miss any spots. I'll use pink for the body. Hmm, it reminds me of someone. This is my favorite class. That's it. All done. Hmm, this is tough. Wait, I've got it. I'll need my ruler. I'll start with a straight line. I really hope this works. It's gonna be so different. I'll make some dots here. Then it's time to add a splash of color. I've divided my bird into sections. I'll fill each part separately. I've also added tabs around the bird. They'll come in handy later. I have a good feeling about this. Everyone is gonna be amazed. The body is almost finished. Then I can color the beak. I'll take my time. I don't want to ruin it. I've put so much effort into it. <laughs> Blue hair. So cool. Hmm. I'll make the wing the same color. It's almost done. I need to cut it out. The dotted lines are where I need to fold it. It makes it so much easier. I just need to follow the lines. And then make a crease. The tabs help stick it together. I'll use glue to secure it. It's a little more work, but it's totally worth it. That's the last one. Check it out. What do you think? I hope you like it. <laughs> Aw, it's so good. Well done. Wait until you see this. Oh, wow. That's very creative, Leo. <laughs> Wait, it's following me around the room. It just keeps staring at me. That's kind of freaky. It doesn't blink. Yikes. I must be imagining it. Ah, there's more! They're everywhere! There's no escape! I'm surrounded! What? What is happening? I don't feel so good. I've got birds on the brain. So, do you like them? Uh, sure. I knew it! Uh, you can have this lollipop. Ooh, yummy! Thanks! Hmm? I enjoyed that. Aw, I wanted a lollipop. Don't be sad, Lexi. You can have this. Ah, that's so sweet. You're the best, Leo. Mmm, it's delicious. <laughs> huh? Where's that coming from? I think it's my phone. How did that get in there? You have a lot of things in your bag. Aw, my unicorn! Aha! Here it is! Hello? Oh, hey, how's things? Uh, where are you going? I guess she's not serious about the challenge. Uh, okay, so this puppet is the next object to inspire you. Hmm, what should I do? There must be something I can use. Hang on, I can use this rolling pin. I'll start by painting dots onto it. I'll put them all the way across the rolling pin. Once I've done that, I'll switch to orange paint. I'll work my way through the colors of the rainbow. This is so relaxing. Almost done. There, that should do it. Now it's time to roll it over the page. I'll take my time. I don't want to cause any smudges. Steady, nice and slow. Look at that. It's just like a poppet. Ooh, I know. What did I miss? Nothing much. I'm a poppet. Pretty cool, huh? Uh, Lily? I feel so alive! Look, Stacy. You know you look ridiculous. Maybe you're the odd one out. I'm so confused right now. Look at my painting. It looks just like us. What about you, Stacy? You do have a painting, right? No, of course not. I was on a call. I'm disappointed. Matthew wins. Yes! Better luck next time. I need new friends. Have a cool idea for an art piece, but not sure how to tackle it? Don't worry, we've got some handy little tricks to turn regular ideas into true masterpieces. Now let's get those creative juices flowing! Hmm, my crush has me feeling inspired. I sure hope he appreciates this. Here goes nothing! Uh, what's up, David? Nice. What'd she write to me? Yep, I've got some feelings about this. <laughs> Be still, my heart. Let's see here. Gah! 
My books! Sorry. Let me help you with those. Oh. So soft. Uh-huh. Wow. Um, my books? Oh, right. So… Yeah. Thank you. I think I'm in love. Wait. Just one last look. Yep. This guy is really something. Ah. Uh, oh, that's what I'll say. Nothing like reminding your sweetie about the moment you first laid eyes on each other. The hard part's over. Nice. Wow. I remember. Such a sweetheart. Love you, baby. Prepping for your art project is all part of the process. A messy one at that. Anyway, time to turn this idea into art. First stroke is always the best. Add a little bit of blue here. It's really coming together. Or is it? This is terrible! Nope. Good thing I have lots more paper. Ooh, smooth. This is worse than the first one! Ugh! Come on now, focus! You've gotta be kidding me. Why can't I paint a stupid flower?! All right. Stay calm. Deep breath in. I can do this. I am fully capable. It's go time. Easy. Easy. Shoo! Huh? That was unfortunate. But wait a minute. What an interesting shape! I can work with this! Using your paintbrush in different ways can help you create entirely unique designs. And in my case, petals! Once you've gone all the way around, add some green for the leaves and stems. See how it's all coming together? Careful strokes go a long way. You can even attach these two. It fills out the space quite nicely. I knew I could do it! Whoa! You drew all this on your own? Why don't you have it, Annie? I've got more creating to do. And this time, I'm taking a whole new approach. But don't worry, we're still staying on theme here. See how these strokes make the leaves really come alive? Don't be afraid to take your time with these. You can even make grass, see? But the next part gets a little more complicated. I can use some puffy paints like these to create all new fun textures with a balloon! How satisfying was that? Now use it like a stamp. And you'll get these fun, totally unique flowers. Don't forget this one. Cool, right? Awesome! What do you think? <gasps> David! How did you even come up with that? My secret ingredient! I'm about to blow your mind! You kids and your technology! You can't do anything yourself! Whoa! Look at it go! I don't have to do a thing! Pretty clever, huh? And it's all done! A cute little zebra. That's amazing! Ha! I'm old school. I'll dip the wool into this paint, then press it onto a piece of paper. Now I'll add green paint. A delicious apple! No way! It's a masterpiece! Quit it, Granny! How do you like that? That's it! Hey, stop it! There's only one thing for it! That hurts, Granny! What? Where are we? It's time for a challenge! It's gonna get artistic! Keep up, Teddy! Huh? Oh, that gives me an idea! Use your hands! Too easy. I'm gonna need a soundtrack for this. That's more like it. I 
can like this song. It's pretty catchy. Check out these moves. Oh yeah. Pop and lock. Hmm. This is great inspiration. I know what to do for my drawing. I'll just trace around my hand. It's so simple. Now I'll add the details. I'll split it into sections, and now I can add color. I'll just fill in the lines. This is looking good. But I'm not finished yet. This snake looks pretty good. Hey, Tina. I'm all done. This isn't going well. Huh? Liam's finished already? Hold on. All that curly hair is giving me an idea. I know what to draw. Let's do this. I'll hold my hand like this. Then add a fluffy tail. Now I can draw the face. I want it to look cute. I can't forget the ears. And now for the legs. Now I can color it in. This yellow is perfect for the face. And I'll color the ears brown. I'll use red for the flower. And now I'm done. There's only one winner. Ooh, they both look good. I'm impressed. Hmm, this is tough. What do you think, Teddy? We've decided you both win! Congratulations! Put it there, Granny. Ouch! I'm excited! Yeah! Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> but we need some tools. Here! Hey, look over there! Hmm? Yeah! You want to draw that? It's my favorite color, Dad! Alrighty then. Gotcha! Is this the one you wanted? Let's get started then! <laughs> Time it! I'd better get to it then. Son, choose one. It's mine! This is what I have to work with? Hmm. I know. What about that water? This is about to get interesting. Dip the marker in the water. Then put the spray top back on. There! Yeah, this is what I wanted. Dad! <laughs> gotcha! Check this out. You can use different colors, too. Look what you're left with. Try competing with that. Well, check out this masterpiece. Hmm. Aw, oh, man. Yours is way better. It's not fair. Don't cry. You'll get better. Hey, looks like I won. Mm. Wait a minute. <laughs> I have money. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. What? Yep. I want it. Hmm. Please, I want to buy it. You're a good salesman. Here you go. I'm the winner, Daddy! Woohoo! I can live with that. So what's next? Hmm. <laughs> it's been a slow day so far. Ahem, I'm here for a cut in style. Oh yes, I'm happy to help you. Please take a seat over here. Thank you, I will. How's the weather inside? Is it still hot? Okay, now how can I help you today? I just need a little off the ends. Remove the split ends and lift it up a bit. Of course, of course. I can definitely do that for you. I'll just need to adjust your chair. A little more. Just some more. A bit more. Alright, I'm ready to get started. You have beautiful hair. I can tell you take good care of it. I seem to have encountered a snarl. What's going on back there? Why did you stop? <laughs> no worries, don't worry at all. Everything is under control. <gasps> oh my gosh, the dome totally broke in half! Um, what's with that look on your face? Oh, it's nothing, just a little gas. <laughs> what am I gonna do? That was my best comb! Wait, of course, my trusty 3D pen. That'll fix my problem. I've got a picture of a comb, so now I just need to trace it. I'll just fill it in with my favorite pink 3D ink. 
Okay, this is working well so far. There we go, the front half of the comb. And now to start with the handle. I'll use this pretty light green. It's such a pretty color. I don't get to use it that much. And since I'm making a new comb, I might as well make it prettier too. When I'm done with this part, I'll make some flowers too. Okay, almost done. And voila! A new comb. Oh, she fell asleep. Guess I'd better hurry up and finish. Back to combing her hair. Oh, sorry. I must have dozed off there for a moment. Oh! <laughs> it's a bird call. And your first art challenge. Hmm, let's think. Oh, this scarf. This shouldn't be too hard for me. What? Is that what I think it is? Get out of here, you silly bird! <laughs> At least that gives me a leg up here. In fact, I have just the thing to give me that extra edge. Ugh. How did this get in there? Whatever. As I was saying… Huh? Is this some kind of cruel joke? Okay, finally! My stuff! Oh, great. Another boring book. Not helpful. Goggles? None of this stuff is useful at all. What's all this math? Like I know what any of this means. On second thought, I can use numbers to help me. Once I get the body down, I can use a few magic numbers over here. And on the head, too. It's starting to look like a bird, right? Just wait till the color comes in. You okay there, my little chickadee? I'll give you nice, beautiful feathers. With all the colors of the rainbow. It's finished! What do you think? Can you see the numbers in it? Stunning! And you? I got stuck under some bad weather. This is as far as I got. Ooh! You won this round, Annie. <laughs> Aw, yay! For me? Thanks! Mmm! 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 I can't work under these conditions. I guess I should have seen that coming. Come on! Ah, uh, yeah! Whoa. I'm getting pretty good at this. I'm like a heart genius. Come on! Stay in your lane! What? Stupid slow car! Go! 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 Ugh. Do you mind, Betty? Ugh. You don't understand. Ugh. <gasps> Your key! How hard were you hitting that thing? Oh! How am I supposed to play now? This is bad. <sighs> Hand it over! It's mine now! Ugh. Ridiculous! She left her pen! Two can play this game. If you lose a computer keyboard key, use a 3D pen and make one yourself. Just make it tall enough to match your other keys. Now for the moment of truth! Yes! The game stops for no one! Whoa! Betty? You're back! Where was I? Betty! You took my pen without asking! Why are your sisters so annoying? At least I think fast. Whatever. Another peaceful morning. I better get ready. <sighs> Wake up! Morning! Time to brush my teeth! <sighs> I'm still sleepy. Oh, this tickles. Ah, my teeth are sparkling. Oh no! Maybe she won't notice. Okay, what's next? Makeup's looking good. Oh, my earrings. I better put them on. Hmm, where's the other one? Don't look at me! No idea! She suspects nothing. This is so strange. What am I gonna do? Hmm, I think I have an idea. Using a 3D pen, start to draw a triangle. Just like this. Keep the lines tight together. Once you reach the base of the triangle, start to use a different color. We want to make a watermelon. Use different colors of green for the rind. Then add black dots for the seeds. Randomly add the black dots, covering the red plastic. Once you've finished, flip it over and add an earring stud. That looks fashionable and delicious. But we're not done. 
Use the 3D pen to draw small lines. Repeat this on the opposite side. We want to create a leaf shape. This is looking good! Flip the leaf over and attach a small clear straw. Use scissors to cut the straw. This will hold the leaf to your ear. Wow! These look great! Huh? Oh, uh, I want to be a plumber! I knew it! Perfect! Liam! Snacks ready! I know oranges are your favorite! No! Not before we wash our hands! You know the rules! They're clean, okay? Hey! Hands sink! Fine. This is ridiculous. But if she wants clean hands, fine. I'm using lots of soap, mom. Whoa! This thing sure is slippery. Hey! I can't get a good grip on it. No! Just forget it. I'll clean, see? I'm just so hungry. Oh, stay right there. Time to tinkle. Whoa! Oh no! <gasps> Liam! Huh? What did I do now? I nearly fell on my head. <gasps> the soap! What's it doing down here? It's like it grew legs or something. Come on, stay up there. Wait a minute. I think I have an idea. A 3D pen can help keep your soap in one place. See all these squiggles? They'll all hold onto the soap for ya! Drawing them right onto the soap makes this thing the perfect shape! But we're not done yet! Use the pen to color in this illustration. We chose a unicorn. Use different colors to make it more dynamic. Simply release the color gel with back and forth motions. And voila! A unicorn! Check out this adorable soap dish! Put it in! And if it's nice and snug, nicely done! I'm keeping my eyes on you! Okay, this spot looks substantial. Yeah? The trees, nature, what have you. The heat is on! You bet! I don't know… What? Hey, stop looking at mine! Whatever, fine. I'll be over here then. What can I paint? He's adorable! I hope David didn't see him. I saw it first! Uh-huh. May the best bird painter win! A few skillful circles can go a long way. Just have to know where to add the lines. Nice, right? But some color will really make it pop. Yellow is such a happy color, isn't it? It's perfect for such a cheerful guy. And how about some green? Such a peaceful hue. And add some blue for a real treat for the eyes. Doing the edges first is always best. It really rounds things out, doesn't it? Almost done. Just a couple of finishing touches. And that's how it's done, folks! A true masterpiece! Don't you agree? Yep, I'm pretty pleased. What is that? I just needed an extra hand. Turns out, a hand is all you really need. Well, that and a few strategically placed dots and lines. Can you see the bird face yet? Don't worry, it'll all come together soon. These branches ought to give it away. And here are its cute little feet. A little greenery? I think it's quite peaceful. Can you see the bird now? 
I'm just so creative, aren't I? Well, if you really want to see it… Not too shabby. Oh. I guess they're both pretty great. Should we ask the teacher? Seriously? I hope he's okay. Seems like he's just fast asleep. Hey! Ooh. All done, huh? Oh, great job. Now just give me, uh, five more minutes. Alrighty then. 